Pathfinder also has full cover flow support, both in Leopard and Snow Leopard. And if we actually switch on the cover flow icon, you might notice one immediate difference. And that's uh, cover flow is supported not just on list view mode, but also on column view mode as well, as well as icon view mode. So you don't have to always go back to list view mode. It is supported there as well, but you can have it in any of the views. Now we have a resizable pane just as normal, so we can make it smaller or bigger. And again, we're not restricted to just list view. We can have the same view in any of the three modes. So that's a very neat feature. Support for Quick Look. So if we uh, go in and uh, select something, the new theme music, for instance, then hit the Quick Look icon. Well, we also have support via the spacebar, so I can just hit spacebar. Uh, next to the Quick Look icon is an action menu icon that just gives us uh, rapid access to some commonly used shortcuts. The next block of icons have uh, specific uses. For instance, we have uh, a Get Info button. Now we have an extended Get Info panel uh, within Pathfinder, so we have lots of information within this first info box. We also have uh, access to additional attributes, so we can go in, hide the extension, switch on bits, make them locked, make them invisible, etc. Uh, we also have a cleaner and uh, probably more comprehensive way of going in and changing permissions. We can actually just click these buttons to change the permissions of the files. Uh, a preview and an open with as per the standard uh, find a get info button. Uh, options to burn, options to access your iDisk directly, uh, a select tool, which we'll look at separately, and a delete icon. And over on the right hand side, a find tool, a connect tool, and a filter box, all of which we'll have a look separately because they do provide some, uh, some enhanced functionality. Uh, before we move on, though, let me just show you quickly uh, one of the uh, well, one of my favourite parts of Pathfinder, and I think one of the most popular, and that's its uh, capability of creating a dual pane view. Although the Finder and Pathfinder itself has support for spring-loaded folders, whereby you can actually drag uh, files onto a folder and watch it pop open, then navigate through the hierarchy. Sometimes it's just easier to have two separate windows open. Now on the Finder. That normally involves you having to open two separate Finder windows. But within Pathfinder, there is a dual pane option. So uh, all we need to do to invoke the dual pane option is go down to the bar at the bottom. Now, this first icon removes the sidebar, but we'll pop the sidebar back. But the next icon switches it into dual pane mode. Now, once we click the icon, we have instantly two completely independent uh, views of our file system in two separate panes. Now, currently the left-hand pane is active. You can see a very faint blue border around the edge. If I click on this one here, you'll see the blue border changes to the right-hand panel. Let's go back to the left-hand panel. If I wanted to go to, say, pictures, uh, let's have a look at my photo booth. Now, these are all the photos from um, a show when I did the Mac montage with some of the screencasts online viewers. Now, if I wanted to drag and drop uh, one or all of these across to a share, say, on my Mac Pro, I have a... Uh, Mac Pro O2 Stripe set set up here. I click on the right hand panel, uh, select that in the sidebar, and I can see instantly the file structure over on the remote machine. So there's a transfer option here. So we'll go into the transfer directory, and then I just drag a file across, drop it, and there we go. That's transferred the file across to the remote machine. Now, even better is that, uh, as I mentioned, each window is completely independent. If I go back to this particular window, switch on cover flow. So you see I have cover flow immediately available uh, for this particular file system that I'm looking at. Again, more of the screencast online viewers and no cover flow over here. If I wanted cover flow, I could select, uh, click on cover flow, and lo and behold, I have cover flow in, uh, in both panes. Uh, let's just switch that off. Click over here and switch that off. So probably out of all the uh, power user features within Pathfinder, the uh, dual pane option is probably the one I like the most and probably one I use the most.